Officials at the Bahamas Red Cross Society are looking to raise at least $100,000 with the 45th annual Grand Raffle, which was launched just outside Kelly's home center this morning. Store owner Nancy Kelly stressed the need for Bahamians to support the cause as the nonprofit organization is responsible for several outreach programs, including its Meals on Wheels, School Milk Scheme, and the After School Mentoring Program, all designed to help the less fortunate. She got the ball rolling to purchasing the first tickets, buying $50 worth of her own. Meals on Wheels delivers approximately 150 cooked meals in Nassau and 50 meals in Freeport um, each week. For this, they have to buy about $100,000 worth of food a year. They tutor kids, younger kids that need help. And at, and at this tutoring program, they also feed them a snack. They have about 250 walk-ins every month that people in real need that can't find food. And they donate about $65 worth of basic food to these people to take home to their families. I feel um, that we, the general public needs to give more money and the corporate citizens to this very worthwhile organization that helps so many people in need. Now the $100,000 figure reportedly covers only about one-sixth of the Red Cross's annual expenses. Three of the country's beauty queens are also joining in the Red Cross's effort. The grand prize is a fully loaded 2018 Red Suzuki and one year of free insurance. The raffle will be drawn on Saturday, September 29th at 6 p.m. at Solomon Super Center East West Highway. Past President Lady Igwe Darling is urging all who can help to chip in. The Red Cross has been losing on our fundraising efforts in a big way. You look at the fair that we had, it's a lot of work, and we did not get the kind of revenue that we thought. So now you have the raffle. We can make up for the fair. Please come and buy the tickets for the car. We're depending on you. You've heard of all of our programs, and like everything else in the world, when prices goes up, then our work takes more money to do the same jobs we've been doing for years.